Long Time No See with Arrol Beyonce and Movie Reviews. This time we have a David Cronenberg movie, a History of Violence. This one dates a little bit back. It's not exactly a new movie, but it's definitely worth a watch or even a rewatch like it was in my case. This is a very, very simple story based on a book that tells about man having a so-called second life. I mean, the past is now forgotten and put aside and there is a new family with kids and a nice, beautiful wife. But things go south when your history starts to haunt you once again. That is, they will dig about your past and they are going to reclaim what's theirs, anyway, according to their opinion. And that's where things go south, or for the viewer, exciting. There's interesting level of drama. It starts slow, it starts building up nicely, and when the action starts to heat up, it's almost like all the way John Wick style. Vicko Mortensen is doing a wonderful job with the movie, and I could say the same about the other actors and actresses as well. Mario Bello being the beautiful wife and having some clues what's going on. But what the what viewer doesn't necessarily know is that this is partially drama and partially action movie. It's kind of a sliding in between the two extremities, and that makes this movie nice and well um, tempoed, if you will. I am strongly recommending you to give this one a go. It has uh, gotten older quite nicely, so it doesn't feel like too outdated. Yet, at the same time, the story is very much ageless. A good, solid story, which I hope to give you a go. Don't know where the availability for streaming services, but I guess you will dig that up for yourself if you're interested. Strongly recommend it with giving a score of 8 out of 10. This is Rolly Beyond, see you soon, more reviews coming away.